Uh, hi, Greg Russell, NBC Detroit. Alexander, how are you? I'm good. Good afternoon. How are you? Doing well. Good to see you. Likewise. You're gonna see, I, I like your background with the moving around and all like that. It's fascinating. Quite beautiful, huh? Yes, it is. It's like yes. I'm floating in the clouds here. <laughs> <laughs> Which sounds like a fun thing to do, you know? Oh, yeah. Especially like for your character, when I think about this, the story's almost kind of Shakespearean where something happens to your character's uh, dad when he's young and he spends his life wanting to avenge what happened to his father, right? Yeah. I mean, it. it's very much Shakespearean because Shakespeare based Hamlet on Prince Hamlet of Jutland, a, a story by Saxer Grammaticus from the 12th century. Um, and that is the, the, the template, the story that we based the Northmen on. Mm -hmm. So it's basically the, the predecessor to, to Hamlet. Is That's basically the story. Mm -hmm. And like I said, just seeing this kid, you know, just starting out as a child and growing and then becoming as powerful, you know, as he is. But another big element, I mean, of course, the acting was, you know, fabulous, but just the action alone, your guy not only put it out, but he also took it in a lot. Yeah, yeah, I uh, was definitely um, quite bruised after some of those <laughs> scenes. Um, there's one in which I... I I uh, have to fight Hafthor Bjornsson, which is um, uh, the mountain on Game of Thrones, if, if, if your viewers are familiar with that show. Mm -hmm. um, and he is literally the strongest man on the planet. He won that competition a few years back. Um, and that, you do not want to fight him. Uh, I tried it and I failed miserably. It's, uh, <laughs> that was a, a week of very painful shooting uh, He's a lovely man and, 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 and try to be gentle, but he's so much bigger than I am and so much stronger that just a light tap on the shoulder, Ooh. I went flying. So it, uh, it was a week of just ice baths uh, after that. I so say, did you have to keep reminding him too? You know, this is a movie. This is a movie. No, again, he, <laughs> almost the opposite. He was so gentle and he's aware of the fact that he is very, very strong. Um, <laughs> But obviously on camera, it, he has to look ferocious. And, and um, so he had to sell it. So I, I definitely didn't ask him to, ho to hold back, but <clears throat> um, he sure did because otherwise I wouldn't be sitting here today, but it, would, it was still painful. Right, and, and like you said, he, he sold it. That's for darn sure. Oh yeah, yeah, I know, he's, he's incredible. Right, you saw him and it's like, oh my God. And it's also amazing We you think this took place, I don't remember now exactly, but something like, 850 AD and you kind of see you know how people were back then in regards to you know treating each other and doing things and you think okay it's you know almost uh, 1500 years later things should be better but it's still kind of like the same issues that people are going through today yeah I mean um, unfortunately yeah um, it, there are a lot of um, uh, similarities and uh, conflicts that I think we can um some of us personally relate to and others at least uh, uh, see around us in, in society. No, that's for sure. Alexander, great seeing you. Enjoy the movie very much. And uh, glad it all worked out where no bones were broken. <laughs> Still alive. All right. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much. I enjoyed Thank it very you. much. Thank you. You too. Take care. Enjoy. Thanks. Thanks.